Hey folks, today we're outside of Edinburgh, Virginia. We are going to be hiking Short Mountain and Copernicus Ridge. Let's do it. So we started our hike on a fire road. This is also the Madison Nutton Trail. And uh, parking here is pretty, it's usually pretty good if the ATV parking is open. Otherwise you'll have to park along this fire road. And that's not a problem. One other car here when we got here. The Massanutten Trail is blazed in orange. So our road walk ends at about three tenths of a mile. Now we are on the Massanutten Trail. Ready, pup? Let's go. We are heading southbound out of Edinburgh Gap on the Massanutten Trail. Looking to the north, you can see Wanazi Peak. The trail's a little rocky, but uh, pretty typical. And the incline is not too bad. So it's obviously winter time and making our way on this trail we're noticing some pretty nice views off to the north uh Wyonazi and Maneka Peak you can see way off to the north there and to the east you can see uh Kennedy Peak and the Shenandoah Ridge behind it crunchy so at 1.5 miles out of uh the gap we just we just got to the ridge and there's a small cairn here so we're gonna go check out what's down that path Let's see what kind of views we got come on Whoa. beautiful unobstructed view here to the east all right we're looking at uh, Kennedy Peak out there just beyond it I think that is uh, Stony Man on this side, that's Hawksbill, I believe. Uh, Mary's Rock is somewhere in there, at the top there. Beautiful. All right, now we're looking to the north. Maneka Peak out there, beautiful. That short little side trip uh, past the Karen was absolutely worth it. Heck, we're already up here. And there's, you know, while you're up here, there are a whole bunch of other uh, rocky areas that you can hang out on and not be around a lot of people. I don't think this is a very popular hike in this section of the George Washington National Forest. Um, I could be wrong, but I, I don't think so. So we're turning back onto the Massanutten Trail, still heading south. Let's see what else is awaiting us. I don't think anyone's been on this trail in a while because we are just moving branches every 20 yards. All right, let's keep going. It's a bit of a pain in the butt. All right, just over three miles into our hike, we are uh, on top of Short Mountain. Not a lot going on up here. So the uh, the highlight's definitely that Copernicus Ridge where the um, the little Karen directed us off trail, off the Massanutten Trail. Come on. Copernicus Ridge and Short Mountain. Um, if you're coming here, I would say definitely do Copernicus Ridge. Uh, Short Mountain, it's a ridge walk, and although it's nice, it's probably not everyone's cup of tea. I think we enjoyed it, but uh, we're gluttons for punishment. Um, as far as parking is concerned, I would drive up the Spire Road until you reach the, uh, the part where the Massanutten Trail ducks into the woods. There's parking available right here. So I would do that next time. And 
If you're just doing Copernicus Bridge, it is not that far. You know, it's not a long hike. Um, so I might tack that on to something else in the area, like Kennedy Peak is right across the, uh, the valley. Do that, come over here, knock this out. It'd be a pretty nice day. It had some really nice views. It's not a 360 view kind of place, but, um, but they're very nice nonetheless. All right, well, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later.